Good afternoon, Colorado. Welcome to a special edition of What's for Lunch. I'm your host, Larry Herz. And today, in studio, I have Dave from Smokin' Daves and the co-host, Lace Morris, here from Ben Higgins' season of The Bachelor, another Colorado resident. Welcome, both of you. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for having us. So uh, give us a little history of you and Smokin' Daves. Smokin' Daves. Um, Smokin' Daves started in 2007. Um, our first store, uh, we started in Estes Park. Colorado, and we have since grown to five and a half stores. <laughs> and, well, because uh, one is seasonal. Because one is seasonal. Um, our closest store is uh, just a, a rock throw down the street down well, here in Centennial. All the locations. Uh, so we have Estes Park, we have Lyons, we have Longmont, we have North Denver, Adams County, and then we have Centennial. The one in North Denver is like right off 36, right? 36, Pecos and 36. Okay, and how would you describe your barbecue? You know, I'm a California boy, so I can't say that I grew up in a specific style. Um, so I'm trying to honor different styles from method style ribs, even though they're a little saucy today. Um, they're not as dry, but I've got Texas brisket. Um, we've got, uh, you know, some of our Carolina pork. So you don't, you don't, you're not like I do Texas style. I do Kansas City style. You just do smoking day style. I do what uh, what I enjoy doing. I do, uh, you know, I take some traditional flavors, and we add our twist to them. Um, so, yeah, no, I, I think we do a very nice job with what we what we have. And Lace, are you a barbecue fan? I'm a huge barbecue fan. Have you been to a Smoking Dave's? <sighs> yes. You have? Yeah, a long time ago. <laughs> oh, all right, that's good. Um, what looks good to you here? Um, I re actually, you said that the ribs are a little saucy. I like the ribs saucy. Okay. I like them a little messy. So yeah, gonna, and, and, and we don't, we just lightly, we, yeah. we call it baptizing our ribs, uh, but we, we just lightly baste them just to, to get a nice sheen on them. If any of you guys follow me on Instagram, you know I'm a huge Smoking Dave's fan. You've seen me post for him a dozen times. Um, tell him some of your special days, because uh, I think Wednesdays are incredible. Yeah, and this is where I get confused, because we, 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 <laughs> we've got different stores with different specials. But Mondays, um, we have 75 cent wing days. Uh, Tuesday so smoked wings, and they are smoked wing. Um, we have one right here. This was it actually has a dry rub on it. Um, and then Tuesdays we do uh, some tacos, and we do a brisket taco, we do a pork taco, we do fish. Um, so you really do do it your way. We do do it our way. So today's Taco Tuesday. Today is Taco so Tuesday. They're dollar off? What are they? I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> Two dollars off. I'm looking for. I'm looking for the consultation. <laughs> Two dollars. <laughs> Two dollar pork, three dollar brisket. Brisket, there you go. Yeah. Okay. And tomorrow's but, the best because it's all you can eat ribs. You still it's do all that? you can eat. Yep, yep. We do do that. All you can eat ribs. Um, we do our St. Louis ribs, and basically it's all you can eat ribs and all you can eat sides. All you can eat cornbread. Sixteen ninety five. And we hope that you fill up on the sides. And the I mean, sixteen ninety five is like less than ribs for, uh, are in a normal place. Um, Absolutely. For a couple. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. And all you can eat is sixteen. And then Thursday. No share. Yeah, and no, no. I mean, that's fair. And no, no takeout. And no no takeout. takeout. Yeah, unless you touch them all, you know. Yeah. And then he's still doing prime rib on Thursdays. We are still doing smoke, smoke prime, prime rib, rib on, on Thursdays. That's my favorite yes. day. Yes. I'll be there. Yes. And that's sixteen ninety five. Also. Yes, that is sixteen ninety five. It's insane, right? So, um, so. I do have a question about the yes. wings. Do you have different flavors for the wings? Yeah, we do. No, um, we have our traditional spicy. Uh, we have um, our sweet original, which we use our sweet sauce. Okay. Uh, we have a Thai chili. And we also do a habanero, oh. a mango habanero sauce yeah. as well. So, and then uh, we just picked up our dry rub, okay. and that's got a really nice black and seasoning to it. So. Uh, let's jump into the food. I'm gonna yeah, start putting absolutely. over here the close-ups. Tell everybody what's on this tray. Okay. I'll point as you talk. Oh, is that a hush, hush puppy? puppy. <laughs> hush puppy down. <laughs> so hush puppy. Hush puppy. That's our, our brisket. Okay. That's our pulled pork. Yeah. We've got our cheddar jalapeno sausage. Which is wow. Wait, cheddar well, fried? it's 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 a new recipe. Um, okay. We're working with um, Continental Sausage here in Denver. Uh, we worked together and collaborated, and uh, they produce it's an all natural pork um, and all natural casing. Look so it's you. it's a fantastic product. Yep. All right, we talked about the St. Louis ribs. We got our St. Louis ribs. Uh, these and, are amazing. And then we got our cornbread that's got some uh, it's got some specialties. You in put it. cream corn in it. We have cream corn. Yeah. We have cream cheese. We have yeah. sour cream. Wait, you had me at cream cheese. <laughs> so and you yeah, might how they can get dry. Yeah, yeah, they're, yeah, they're, they're nice, nice and moist. Nice yeah. and moist. Did yeah. we hit everything on here? I think yeah. we hit everything on there. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's move on to sides. <laughs> Sweet. Nothing like uh, nails against the blackboard. <laughs> uh, jump into all these sides real quick. Can you see them all, Josh? Or no? 
And I just brought, um, so we have our, uh, our southern green beans. Shocking it's our enough. version of a southern green bean. We're not taking a canned green bean and cooking it for hours and hours and hours. We actually take a fresh green bean, which is called a Heracovera green bean. And we saute it with uh, onions and smoked bacon. Mm -hmm. And uh, just with a, a touch of garlic, pepper, and salt. A little bit of crisp? A little bit of crisp. They are definitely all done. Okay. That's our uh, baked beans. And we put um, a lot of our trimmings in the baked beans, from sausage to bacon to, to brisket and pork. Um, and those are cooked for, for quite a while. We have uh, some of our sauces in there as well. That's our collard greens. Um, it's got a nice sweetness to them, um, but you know, it, uh, it, it, they're green, so it makes you feel like you're eating something healthy. I've recently <laughs> met a lot of people who really enjoy greens, yeah. and I didn't know they were such a thing. <laughs> <laughs> if they're done right, they're good. That's our mac and cheese. Um, it's definitely not out of the box, Kraft mac and cheese. Um, we use a cavatappi uh, pasta and we use four different uh, types of cheeses in it and heavy yeah. cream, and then we top it with a, a panko. I love the crisp on the top. I'm definitely gonna try that. That's the key. And then this is our, just our traditional coleslaw. We switched to a chopped um, slaw, it's just easier. I've noticed things hanging out of people's mouths and <laughs> when things like that, so cabin. this is just our, it, I actually took a version of this when I was in Hawaii, um, so it's got a nice sweetness and creaminess to it. We gotta get this, because we didn't get the chicken. So we do uh, roast our chicken. We do not smoke our chicken. Okay. I mean, we're smoking all day with everything else. So we do roast it. We do a, a dry rub um, with our uh, house-made uh, rubs, and then uh, we roast it off and then finish it off on our char broiler. That looks like a different rib. That's actually a buffalo rib. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Buffalo yeah, rib. so that's our buffalo rib. Um, we have it at all locations, yeah. and we actually make a, a, a blackberry um, yeah, sauce. Yeah, it looks like a different bowl. sauce. Yeah. Can yeah. you get that sauce with these ribs? If Absolutely, you want? yeah. Is it yeah, sweeter? Just, um, it's not as it's it's got a sweetness to it, but I think with the uh, with the it's got a little bit more texture because of the mm -hmm. seeds and, and stuff like that from the fruit. And I I didn't even know you had dessert. I've never gotten that. We far. never got that far. No, <laughs> no. I fill up so much on on everything else. Well, this is four of our desserts. We have we have a couple more, um, but I brought our uh, chocolate and pecan bread pudding um, with a whiskey cream sauce, and we just drizzled a, a little bit of chocolate over that as well. Um, we, we had our pecan pie, a uh, little bit of a tragedy, but we tried to salvage as much as possible. So that's <laughs> our pecan pie. Good. It's definitely bigger when you come inside the store. We have our apple cobbler. Um, it's got uh, cranberries in it, uh, fresh apples, Granny Smith apples, brown sugar. It's just uh, ooey and gooey. And then these are our uh, Rocky Mountain beignets. Um, and we serve them with vanilla ice cream. And we top it with powdered sugar yeah. and caramel and chocolate sauce. <laughs> Do you believe that I get paid to do this show? No, this is amazing. <laughs> You're going to be my co-host every day? I'm actually here. Yeah, I'm in. Um, something else, I'm going to pimp you up some more that you would never believe. This guy makes an incredible Reuben. Oh, yeah. right. we, we smoke our corned beef in-house, uh, thinly slice it, and we have a fresh sauerkraut. It's, it's really good. And we actually do a variation of that, too. We do a, a, a salmon Reuben that, uh, oh, that sells very well, yeah. too. So as opposed to like most barbecue places these days are like fast casual, he sit down, mm -hmm. full bar, great beer selection, and um, has has a variety on his menu, like chicken marsala, catfish, like. So we have non barbecue items as well. I brought primarily our barbecue yeah. genre, yeah, but uh, we have burgers and great salads, catfish, like like Larry was saying, uh, chicken marsala. We do a smoked meatloaf as well in house with balsamic uh, cream sauce. Uh, so we have a nice nice selection of items. Got it. Mouth is watering. Got any questions for him? <laughs> Um, I mean, I'm going to ask you the typical question. Mm -hmm. What is your favorite thing on your menu? I'm a rib guy, you know, <laughs> I, so I automatically go to the ribs, yeah. but I'm also the scavenger. I've been, I've been kind of nicknamed the scavenger. So I'll come in and if I see a, an overcooked or, a, you know, something that a mistake, you know, I, I just eat that. But, um, I'm, I'm definitely a wing guy or excuse me, a, a rib guy. Um, if, if I'm going to do something next to that, I go to my sausage and I, and I love our pulled pork. But yeah, yeah. Right, least, yeah. you got to pick something to eat. What's it gonna be? Okay, I actually changed my mind. I'm gonna try this one. That's a good choice. What are you I'm choosing? Going, I'm going here. Okay. This is right in front of me. Right. Dave, give me your website. Uh, we're smokingdavesbbq.com. Uh, smoking with an I. And we also, to make it simpler, davesbarbecue.com. We also own oh, that I as well. Know that. Yeah. And then um, all locations open for dining. All locations are now open for dining. Uh, again, we're seasonal. On our on our fifth and fifth or half, and that store. one's Estes, right? Yeah, and we'll open that one up uh, April first, and then we close that October thirty first. Okay. But yeah, enjoy, Cheers. buddy.
Cheers. Thanks for coming in. Go. Dave, always a pleasure to see you. Thanks for having me. What do we say? Let's eat. Let's eat. <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow for another episode of What's for Lunch. Hmm. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, wow.